YouTube. Welcome back to another video. So we're headed down to Thermal in a couple days. Today is Tuesday. I have my bag like half packed. Um, I was kind of gonna keep it a secret while we were going down to Thermal, but obviously seeing the tile. Um, we are headed down to try horses, which is really exciting. Um, I'll explain more probably with the voiceover during some of the clips as to why we're looking for a new horse. But I have a lesson tomorrow and I figured I would just kind of bring you guys along. Okay, hello everybody, this is voiceover Finn. So, I just wanted to explain why we're looking for a new horse, and what type of new horse we were looking for. Um, basically, Thor can do bigger, and I had dreams of doing bigger with him, but he's not super comfortable bigger than 2'9 and 3 foot. so we were looking for a horse to take me through the big act, um, whether that's a prospect or a horse that's already been there, done that. So the first horse I got on was this really cute 9 or 10 year old bay gelding. Um, I really liked him to begin with. Uh, he had a super nice trot and was a really good size for me. I think he was like 16, 2, something like that. Not super big. Um, yeah, I really liked him to begin with and he put up with a lot of my mistakes throughout the whole thing with, without putting up a fight or making a scene about it, which was really nice. You can see here too that he just does not care even when I put him at a super bad distance because I was really nervous. And then this was the next horse we tried. He was like really big, like 17, 2, something like that. Just coming out of the jumpers. Um, obviously gray, gelding. Um, yeah, I liked him just a little bit too much horse for what I was looking for and for my size. And then we got on this, I think also around 16 hand. I think he was seven, he was pretty green, so that's kind of why we didn't get him. He also had a pretty short stride. And then I rode this horse, um, who we kind of just a little bit he was also really big for me but he had like such a nice trot it was so lovely and then i sat on another horse after this but i didn't put any clips because we just did walk trot and he was just too hungry for me And then this was the last horse we tried. We clicked really fast and he had a really, really nice jump. Um, yeah, I just wasn't like fully in love, but he was super duper sweet and was really fun to ride.
So this was the second and final day that we were trying horses. I retried the last horse that I showed you guys um, because my trainers really liked him and he was really sweet. Um, but we took them in like a back arena so that we could like course around a little bit. Um, yeah, we, I really liked him, but he just like wasn't the horse, you know? And then I got back on the first horse we tried again. Um, he was so, so good, and I was like smiling the whole time I was riding him. Um, even with my still made a lot of stupid mistakes, because I'm not super used to the way he travels and goes, unlike the other horse we tried, like the previous one. Um, but he was just super sweet, has the best jump without like jumping me out of the tack. Um, just put up with a lot of mistakes, like here, I think we did like a figure eight, and I just couldn't pick a distance, and was pulling to nothing, and then we came around and corrected it, and he just did not care, which was super nice. And then this was the last horse we got on, um, we kind of just, it was last minute, um, I liked him, he just wasn't super duper adjustable, and was a little bit too hungry for me, so we just did like flat work. And then that was kind of the end of our horse trying saga at Thermal. He went and visited Joshua Tree the next day before he went home. 